Hello everyone, welcome to Mathematics Tutorial. So today, we will discuss on how to find the roots of a quadratic equation by or using quadratic formula. So in the quadratic formula, x equals negative b plus minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So ang b squared minus 4 for AC is called the discriminant. So the discriminant determines the roots of a quadratic equation. So mag-base tayo sa determin determinants or discriminant rather. So malalaman natin yung roots ng quadratic equation. So number one, if B squared minus 4 AC is greater than zero, so greater than zero, if the value of B squared minus 4ac is greater than, so mas malaki sa 0, so the equation has two different real roots so dalawa yung roots nya, dalawa yung value nya next, if b squared minus 4ac equals 0 so if the value of b squared minus 4ac is equal to 0 so the equation has only one real roots so only one and number three if b squared minus 4ac less than zero so if the value of b squared minus 4ac is less than zero so meaning that is negative numbers so the equation has no real roots so walang real roots so the so ito quadratic equation has at most two roots meaning it can have none, one, or two based on this discriminant. Okay? Pwede wala, pwede isa, pwede dalawa yung roots ng quadratic equation. So, let's find an uh, example. Let's try example rather. So, number one, we have using the quadratic formula, find the roots of 2x squared plus 10x plus 8 equals 0. So, we will use quadratic formula to solve this given. So, ang given natin is 2x squared plus 10x plus 8 equals 0. So, identify natin ang A is 2, ang B is 10, and yung C is positive 8. Then, formula in finding the quadratic or the roots is x equals negative B plus minus square root of B squared minus 4AC all over 2 a. Then, we need to distribute the value of B. So, ang B is 10. So, that is negative 10 plus minus square root of B squared. That is 10 raised to 2 minus 4 times the value of A is 2. The value of C is 8 over 2 times 2 equals so negative 10 plus minus square root of this one magiging 100 subtract 4 times 2 that is 8 times 8 that is 64 over 4 ok next so, equals negative 10 plus minus square root of square root of 100 minus 64 that is 36 that is the value of discriminant so since the discriminant is 36 which is greater than 0 so the equation has two real roots so over 4 so we have negative 10 
plus minus square root of 36, that is 6 over 4. Next, to find the value of x, so una, x equals negative 10, unay natin yung addition, plus 6 over 4. So equals negative 10 plus 6, that is negative 4 over 4, so that is negative 1. Ito una. And x equals negative 10, then subtract 6 over 4, so equals negative 16 over 4, so that is equivalent to negative 4. So the roots are negative, so the roots are negative 1 and negative 4. So there are two roots because of this, ito, dito natin malaman, so the value of the discriminant is greater than 0, that is 36. So there are two roots, negative 1 and negative 4. Next, another example. Ito. Find the roots of the quadratic equation given. So, identify natin ang letter A. The value of A is 4 and B is 12 and C is 9. Then, we will use quadratic formula x equals negative b plus minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a substitute natin so that is negative value ng b is 12 plus minus square root of uh, 12 raised to 2 minus 4 times 4 times 9 over 2 times 4. Next, simplify. Negative 12 plus minus square root of 12 times 12, that is 144. Subtract 4 times 4, that is 16. Times 9, that is 144. Over 2 times 4, that is 8. So, that is equivalent to negative 12 plus minus 2 magiging 0 over 8. So, pag ang discriminant, if negative b squared minus 4ac equals 0, so there are only 1 roots or root. So, magiging x equals negative 12 over 8 so or x equals a lowest term so that is negative 3 over 2 so this since the discriminant is 0 so the equation has only real root that is negative 3 over 2 so ito na yung value ng x natin ok example number 3 we have find the roots of x squared minus x plus 2 so, ang value ng a natin is 1. So, that ito. The value of b is negative 1. So, ito. And c is positive 2. So, x equals uh, negative b plus minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. Substitute natin. So, negative b. Negative times negative 1 plus minus square root of uh, negative 1 squared minus 4 times 1 times 2 over 2 times 1. Equals negative times negative 1 that is positive 1 plus minus square root of this one magiging positive 1 subtract negative 4 times 1 times 2 that is negative 
8 over 2. So, equals 1 plus minus square root of 1 minus 8, that is negative 7 over 2. So, since the discriminant is less than 0, hence the equation has no real roots. The roots are called imaginary roots. So, ito. So, the discriminant, uh, no real roots because the roots are called imaginary imaginary roots because the value of the discriminant is less than zero okay so imaginary roots okay that's all for today